Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. Don't take it personal. <laughs> you Turks are all the same. Huh? All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. No need to get right! So it's my turn? That's enough out of you. Can't keep eyes. I got open. this. Okay. I'm awake. Gotta get I'll show you what I can do. Come on, then. Enjoy the ride. We'll make it quick. Leave it to me. Here he comes! This one's for you! Mm. Okay then. <laughs> so, you had enough yet? No. I don't believe that I have. Just stop it! Can't. It's my job. Then think about changing careers. Gonna get windy! Cloud's pretty strong, isn't he? I've seen this type before. You don't know me. You're going down! What the? Watch out for high winds! Please, just leave us alone. You know I can't do that. <clears throat> hey there, partner. <gasps> I'm sure you're having the time of your <gasps> life, but we're needed on standby <sighs> for a job at something about <sighs> Sector 7. <clears throat> so get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? Wait a sec. So, you coming?
Uh, you talking to the... Shh. So, yeah. It was that kind of day. Shouldn't keep mom waiting. Hey, what'd they say? Good work today, guys. Kidding. They didn't say a word. But, you know... Uh, never mind. It's not like you'd believe me, after all. Hmm. Probably not. Tell me anyway. Really? Yeah. It won't be much longer now. The flowers, they... They have something important to tell us. Something they... Need to share with us. At least, that's the feeling I get. But, before they can... There's a final step that has to be taken. Otherwise, we won't hear them. Maybe I should just give up. Honestly, it's what I do best. Could have fooled me. From what I've seen, you're no quitter. Well, today's special. That's why I've been working my butt off. Uh, what's so special about it? <laughs> okay, time to go. Learn to talk to her. Did the flowers say anything? Uh, good work today, guys? <laughs> That's the spirit! You're heading in already? Yeah. That's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry. We got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask, but would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl that could keep you on the straight and narrow and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say.
Don't want to overstay my welcome. You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. Oh. <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> Nothing. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time. And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. And now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Uh. So I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid.
It's been like this, you know, ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. You're done. Leave this to me. I don't think so. Sorry, but I got it. Not bad. What's that? A big arm. Kinda cute, don't you think? Uh... Oh great. Someone's pulled up the ladder. <sighs> I wonder if we can use this. Idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. Trucking. Hmm. Stop. Did we make it up? I got your number. Try to stay behind me. That way I can move your back. I'm going in. <laughs> Looks like a dead end.
After you. I'll show you what I can do. Huh? So long. Sorry, but I got Great. it. <laughs> That's it! Take it from here. I'll take care of them. Can you take over for Break me? Through it. Maybe this? this. <laughs> Nothing to it. Hey, I bet you can grab that container with the arm. Not half bad. So do you moonlight as a crane operator or something? <sighs> yeah? Huh? Uh, huh. <sighs> oh no, look. Why is it always gotta be so tough? Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Yes, ma'am. Well then, I'm gonna head down. Okay, Cloud! Ready! On a second. Gotcha. Jumping's not an option, that's for sure. Hmm. Look. Hmm? Someone made a campfire. They found a way down. So can we. Seriously. It's on you. I'll show you what I can do. You'll be blown away. We'll make it quick. Gotta get windy. That's it. Gotta go for it now. 
Enjoy the ride! Whoa, not too fast, okay? Got it. Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Mm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? I need to get back. Besides... Looky here, boys! Caught us some burglars! Coming into our homes and stealing our shit? Doing crimes? <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages. <laughs> Can't put in a, a composite. I don't get it. Ah, how stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation for damages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what you get when you, uh, when somebody else. We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah. We were just passing through. Oh, a likely story. <laughs> okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> due recompense, due recompense, due... Do recompense? Uh, no, shit, for brains, due recompense. It's like, uh, uh it's like, uh, 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 compensatory damages. Uh, of course, so I damages that. recompense, I get it. <laughs> what was that? I think we've heard enough. Allow me. But why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Oh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. Huh? What we got here? Fresh meat to test our new toy on. That's what. <laughs> That's good, right? Buzz off. Get ready. 
stupid ladders, always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm, got it? for you in a sec.
That went pretty well. Sure did. Uh. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just... Nope. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, okay? Hold it right there, what you birds! You are passed through our territory! Over here, pal. We made it. Smell the fresh air. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for- Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! Time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? <sighs> so, Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. Okay. Oh. Wow. Uh. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah. I know. Sorry. I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. Won't take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you.
So... <laughs> Go ahead. You gonna be okay getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies. And it's safer, too. <laughs> Guess this is it, then. Ready? Yeah. lost you. What's going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But... I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> Okay. Come on, Cloud. We gotta hurry. You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the rubbish out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Yes, we want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Haven't scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. 
Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out.